Hello and welcome back. In the previous videos, we provided an overview of different types of accounts and how to navigate between personal, business, or enterprise workspaces. Now, you are ready to create your first process. For this, we want to showcase some basic yet important things that will help you use Processio faster. Let's head to the Process Designer and create a new process. This is the Process Canvas where you can see the start and stop actions placed by default. In order to build your flow, you need to drag and drop actions from the toolbar on the left. The toolbar contains around 150 actions. Want to automate sending emails or add some Python or JavaScript code or even convert some PDF to Excel files within your automations? Drag and drop Processio platform action from the toolbar and only the sky becomes the limit. Anything you want to build is available, and if something is missing, you can always go to custom actions and create your own. On the right side, you have shortcuts to access all other Processio tools without leaving your page. You can create credentials, data models, webhooks, schedules, and many more. They are all handy. You can even add email notifications to keep track of the state of your processes after they run. Let's drag and drop some actions on our canvas. Send email, today, and JavaScript. To connect the actions on the canvas, simply drag a connector from one action and drop it anywhere on the other action. To configure an action, click on it, and its properties panel will open. To create automations that use dynamic data, we recommend using process variables. They act as placeholders for data and pass dynamic data between actions when the process is running. Let's add one. Simply click on the plus icon and select a variable. If the process is new, you must create a new variable first. As you can see, it was already auto-assigned to the input where you wanted to use it. Ready to discover more about processes? You can access our knowledge base for more information. Happy automation using Processio!